Building an online course is no different from building many other things. Let me use the building of a mousetrap car as an analogy. When my son was in the sixth grade, he was asked to build a mousetrap car to demonstrate understanding of some principles of physics. Not knowing what mousetrap cars look like, he checked a number of YouTube videos and see how others made them. It is hard to know what is possible without any good models. Once you see how others did it, you may start to have ideas and confidence. When you build online courses, do not start from the vacuum. Check how others did it. Ask to see some examples. Even take one or two popular courses, such as a free MOOC. To build mousetrap cars, students have to use the right tools, often with adult help or supervision. For instance, they will need to use drills to drill holes, tapes to tape things together. In building online courses, you also need tools: tools for creating quizzes, tools for producing media, tools for collecting、uh, assignments. Having a learning management system is just the first step. You will need a toolkit for other purposes. My son's first car was a total disaster, using materials that were not very strong. That's okay. He went on to build another one, learning from the lessons from the first one. Building online courses is the same thing. Some of the things you put online work pretty well. Some don't. You will have to learn and keep making improvements. You see, this car is different from the other one that you just saw. But it works pretty well too. Schools have mousetrap contests. You will be amazed how many types there are. But good ones follow some similar principles. Likewise, there are some principles that govern the design of online courses. You try to make them consistent, helping learners learn and projecting the same image for your institution. But you also have the creativity to make them reflect who you are. And what your discipline requires. Eventually, the mousetrap cars are tested in the field. My son tested on the basketball court, but eventually it was tried out on the school hallway. A basketball court is a very different environment from a narrow hallway. When the course is launched, the student, semester, and many other factors contribute towards a unique environment. If you can do some analysis beforehand, you will go a long way in helping you to facilitate it.